Turn it back out. When women get rejected, a man stops sipping 10. I go lie, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to keep it 100. Like, you know, I have no reason to lie. You know, you, um, you know. I appreciate you for picking me, but I uh, actually have my eye on somebody else. You're going for the white man and he rejected you. He didn't even purchase you. And that's the, um, and that's the, 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 the white boy need him or some. The, the speed clone. Ain't that the speed clone? If I had a guy named Lewis, I would be so good to him. Hmm. I would be the best girl to a Lewis. If only I could find one. But I don't know. I don't see one anywhere. Lewis is just trying to do his job and wonder why mm. this girl is bothering him. He's too old to be falling for these type of games and most likely is married. As always though, it doesn't right, help when there's old. a camera guy following him and acting like he needs some help nah, or something. Bro, I gotta do better and well, try to be better or something. Like, you know you're older, hey, you ain't got you you playing the chase game. Touching all to give you right back to my play. I said you can have that dude you was touching all on to get you right back to my place. To get your car, but I left it on the bar for you. I left your shit for you, so I don't have to. Do I hear Your water bottle and your vape, they're on the bar right there for you to pick up at your earliest convenience. Because you were touching all on all the motherfuckers. City boy! City boy! What would you rate your riz on a scale of 1 to 10? Um, I'd probably say 8. So you think you could get a guy's number right now? Yeah. All right, let's see. I gotta find a guy that's alone. Hey, hey, hey. Hi, hi, what's your name? I'm Matt. Matt, I'm Sydney. Nice to meet Sydney, you. Sydney, nice to meet you. Can I get your phone number? No, probably not. How, why not? Oh my God. If you're good. I mean, they the had the mistake, bro. They had the mistake. It was just too quick, bro. Hi, my, hi, hi, my name is blah, blah, blah. My name is blah, blah, blah. Hey, you think I can get you? That was like. It was nothing leading up to it at all. I'm gonna do these type of videos. Don't have the camera literally next to the person you're asking the questions to. He's not stupid and not gonna fall for these type of games. At least try to be discreet and have the camera guy a little far away. You can see at this point he knew he was being recorded for a TikTok video. Either way though, she got no riz at all. Nice try. Emily, I can't help you carry groceries because it's implying that women are not strong enough to carry all the groceries. I believe in women too much to help you carry these. I'm gonna need you to put all these groceries in the fridge as well. I'm not gonna mansplain how to, you know, organize a fridge. You're way too smart and strong for that, so. You can just put all this away. I'm gonna go play League. I'll see you later. True for there, Ramon. There. I just seen so much cringe within the last 10 seconds, bro. Almost just. Go up to Free no, Strangers no. and ask for a hug. Here's your mic. Hi, guys. Is it okay if I ask you for a hug? No, the man, sorry. No? No. Nope. Excuse me. Oh, yeah, nope. Nice job. Damn. Can I have a hug? Hell no. Nah. Really? <laughs> Can I have a hug, please? You want a hug? Yeah. No, sorry. Nope. This is like the fourth woman doing. <sighs> you want a hug? No, sorry. Like, bro, it's just a hug. <laughs> like, stop making no big deal. Stop being corny. Stop being cringe, bro. Like, y'all niggas don't win for doing this. this. Y'all gotta stop asking random people for a hug, especially when they see you coming up with a camera and a mic. They're just not gonna fall for that type of things. No one bro, is trying to you. look dumb or... I hope y'all ain't think y'all gonna be a simp if y'all just hug your own. Bro, I wouldn't even took it as nothing, bro. I'm telling you, I would've took that as nothing. I wouldn't even made it a big deal that. Either. At least try to be discreet and make the camera guy far away or something. Anyways, this is just a weird thing to ask anyone because in their mind, they're just thinking it's a setup. Now y'all know y'all dad wrong for telling her to do a 360, bro. And then they gassed her up when she did a 360 like something was back there, yo. <laughs> As a man, we know that rejection can that's, be that's tough, is crazy. but what if I told you that making one small change to your daily routine could improve your confidence and make you so attractive that women would be mad if you're not interested in them. That's why I'm excited to have Tej Hanley at the sponsor of today's video. Their product had had a positive impact on my life and get started today. Uh -huh. Did that kid say no to you? 
Um, well, I mean, it was like obviously like a setup thing. Yeah, I just that's about that. Like, no, he genuinely he didn't want to kiss anyone. Not me. Not no one. Like no, no, he was not about it. Oh, and really? then he kissed a girl from college. I'm pretty sure. If you guys don't know, this is the clip she's talking about. Do you think our friend Nabil is cute? Yeah, you're cute. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Would you be interested in being Nabil's first kiss? His, yeah, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. No. <laughs> it's crazy because even though it's a set up video to begin with i'm sure she got into her feelings after he kissed that girl from college this guy's most likely the only person who ever rejected her i mean <laughs> just look it's at all these sims in the conversation don't give no guy y'all phone to quit their number in because this guy just cashed up himself a thousand dollars and took went on my sister's phone act like he was putting his number in and sent himself a whole thousand dollars city boy that's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. Damn. He went cool like that. That's crazy. But this has gotta be wait, don't wait wait a minute. That must mean she don't got a cash app card or something, cause you usually gotta put a pin to send money. So that means she don't got she need to get a cash app card. What the I fuck wrong with her, bro? She tripping. I'm sorry? Can I ride on the back of your motorcycle? Oh, that's not gonna hurt. It's on my bucket list. Just because it's on your bucket list doesn't mean you can get a ride on a stranger's bike. He clearly was just trying to be respectful as possible when he was trying to say no and rejected her. Also, let's stop asking grown adults for their Snapchat. I don't know about you, but I don't think you should be using Snapchat if you're over the age of 19. Bro is clearly oh, wow. just not interested at all. How often do you put guys in the friend zone? I mean, I have a lot of guy friends. I want you to call one of them and ask them if they want to hook up. I'm calling Jacob Davey. <laughs> you really just name dropped him and I'm leaving that in. This is going to be really humbling if nobody answers me. Jacob Davey. What up? Hey, what are you doing? Nothing, why? I just want to talk really fast. With? I just like, okay, you know how like, yeah, with you. I feel bad because I was kind of like curving you the whole time I was at home. No, oh, you're good. You're good. No, but like, do you want to like fuck when I come back? No. Why? No. Uh, that ass, that ass, like, I fuck with you, but like, not like that. Like, you're like, I don't know. You're just, I don't know how to say it without being. I don't know. You, you, you got it. Yeah. We What's crazy about this is now <laughs> this girl will most likely want him because he doesn't want her and she's gonna think it's a challenge. Bro definitely humbled her though. This is why I preach on not being friends been with someone you have feelings for because nine stage. times out of ten you will never get out of the friend zone and you will just be most likely just wasting your time for something to happen. Also asking someone to smash that you recently said no to is a red flag because he probably thinks you're just setting him up which you are. By making some a TikTok still about saying them. yes to someone some you just still recently still friend zone. This is a classic owner reverse. She'll want him like crazy knowing she can't pull him instantly like she assumed. What would you rate your risk game out of 1 to 10? Like a 7. So basically we're gonna put this to proof today. If you can drop my friend here, like a pickup line. You look very strong, handsome. How about you pick me up tonight? I am that strong. Yeah, I don't think anybody is that strong here. Jesus. Bro, that was so staged and it was corny. I mean, the bar was, it was kind of cool. You know, you get a little effort for it. It wasn't crazy, but it was like, it wasn't the worst shit I heard, but it was corny and staged, so it kind of just blew coverage. So. Let's be honest. Hi, I'm Austin. Serena. Absolute nice pleasure. Nice to meet you. Tell me what you live for, what you plan to die for. My cats. Do you believe they have souls? I mean, I don't know if I believe in souls necessarily because I'm not religious. And relative to humans as well. Well, I believe there's consciousness, right? Were you were you born Christian up here? I was, but I rejected it majority pretty Why much. Why did you reject it? Because I just wasn't really about it. I didn't want to give. 
Who got it first? Me, 100%. I, I, yeah, um, I don't think it's God. I, I can tell. Yeah. <laughs> bro, this guy low key was nervous, bro. Austin. Bro, Actually, you see his knee pleasure. jumping, bro? I think he's nervous. I twice and they did not want my ass. How long were you passionate for that? Not at all. No, <laughs> not, it was just, it was a minor thing. So, what do you hope to achieve in your life? I want to travel a lot for sure. I don't know if I have like a specific purpose in that. There's no goal that accompanies it. <laughs> You don't seem to have any direction in life, whereas I know exactly where I'm going and what I want. And granted, that's nothing wrong with that, but because I know where I'm at and where I'm going, I don't want to have to babysit someone to where Damn, I am. So that's crazy. My guy is killing Damn. me, not because he rejected them. <laughs> yeah, it's how smart he was and just straight up no BS questions. I honestly think these type of dating show is a dumb uh, concept because most people would only press the button because they don't want to be rejected out of fear. Like, it's not that they don't like the person in front of them. They're just afraid they would reject them. So now it becomes a game of who's going to reject who without them even spending enough time <laughs> to even get to know the person. In this case, though, I think most of uh, these girls here wasn't up to par to this guy's standards and the type of girls he's looking for. So I don't blame him for rejecting them. So so they need to be, I think, at least 5'11", but I prefer like 6 feet tall. This is fuck is over. That's crazy. Preference, that wanting someone who's over 5'11 and up is unrealistic, especially when it's only like 14% of people that are 6 feet and over. I promise you, if that girl likes you, she wouldn't care about how tall you are. This girl also believes in astrology, so you already know the type of girl she is. As she get yeah. older, her options are just going to get slimmer and she's just going to have to lower her standards if she ever wants a man. But honestly, they dodged a bullet here because this girl is Don't an OF model the and you already know where she belongs. Oh, she belongs to the street. Oh, she, oh. Oh, I did not know that. <laughs> this goes to a bit of confusion.